Hi, this is Udi from Iolama. If you've been following the channel, you know that one of the things we like to do here is to take time lapses of our prints. We're using the Ender 5 Pro, an Octopi, and a D5300 camera. So the camera is connected to the Octopi, and the Octopi is running Octolapse, and this is what's taking the pictures. We also have a couple of light panels here to maintain good lighting on the printer. You may have also noticed that the camera is positioned in kind of a weird spot here. And the reason that we're doing this is because the plate goes down and we want to have a good angle. And we cannot put the camera in front of the printer because we have this annoying bar. So I've seen a nice bar relocation mode from Joe Saints on Thingiverse. And today we're going to print it and try and move this bar lower so we can put the camera dead on in front of the printer. So let's print it and see how it goes. So here's the printed part. This is printed with Isan PTG, um, the transparent one. And what we're going to do is we're going to place this here and lock it into the frame. Then we're going to put the bar here so it doesn't block the view. You're going to need a couple of those printed parts, six M5 eight millimeter bolts, and you're going to need some peanuts. So let's go ahead and make this mod. The sides of the bar weren't tapped, so I'm just gonna tap them with a screw. I know it's not the best, but uh, we work with what we have. So right now we're preparing the T-nuts, and we're putting a T-nut where it has to be really, really loose. We're putting it like this, aligned, so it'll slide in. And then when we turn the bolt, this will turn around, and we'll give some force so the T-bar doesn't go out. So in the original project, we only had three bolts, um, but we saw a hole here and it fits an M4 bolt that'll uh, make sure this is held in place. So we just added this one bolt. So when we come to choose where to place the bar, if you put it too high, it'll still block the camera. If we put it too low, then we lose structural integrity here. We decided that rod just right here around the mill will be good enough. So we decided that instead of putting them all together, it'll probably be easier to put this one then to put this one and then put the T-bar in the middle. So this is what we're going to do. So you have to make sure that the T-nuts are extremely loose so they turn. Otherwise they just stay in place. And the last one. So now with the crossbar out of the way, we can put the camera where we want it, front and center. If there are any other mods you would like us to do, just let us know in the comments below. Uh, hit the like button, the subscribe button, the share button, hit all the buttons, and we'll meet again in the next video.